reporting live from the SF debate where we stay and you know what we best at. Marcus Hall Studio One, that's the best set. Number one show in the game, at your best bet. We giving y'all quality, y'all better trust that. It's for us, by us, students make the impact. Welcome back to Under SF Debate. I'm your host, Teresa. Oh. And I'm Joshua. My bad, y'all. If this was any other episode, I think I could be mad at you right now, but I guess that this is kind of fitting. I appreciate that. I really do. If you haven't caught on yet, this episode is about food. We'll be taking time to explore the many food options here on our campus, some tips and tricks on getting some bang for your back, and ending some pretty famous debates. So, grab your favorite snack and we'll be right back with Under SF Debate. Keep it here, y'all. I just got back from my yearly checkup. The doctor says it's not looking too good, man. Oh no, what happened? What are you talking about I eat too many vegetables? If I eat one more carrot, it's gonna go down to my thighs. And then I blow up. It's like pop go to weasel, until the weasel go pop. Hey guys, I think the pizza's here. Thank you. Did they forget the ranch? You know what they say? A slice a day keeps the doctor away. Always, always, always! Man, after all that pizza talk, I'm kind of craving a slice right now. Say, you down to go to grab a slice after the next segment? Oh my god, you know that I'm always down for a slice, but between rent and all these classes has me tight on, on money, so I don't have much to spend this month on food. Hmm. That's a bummer. Well, lucky for you, we got this thing called Gator Groceries here on campus. What? Yes. Isn't it wonderful? According to the Associated Student Gator Grocery Program, food insecurity is not a choice, and access to various nutritious food is a human right. Therefore, at San Francisco State University, they strive to provide programming that raises awareness about food insecurity and assists food insecure students in assessing nutritional meals, allowing them to successfully complete and obtain their degrees while attempting to avoid the negative health effects of prolonged food insecurity. Gator Groceries is a direct response to the need of Monda SFSU student population for more resources to fight food insecurity, the lack of access to nutritious food. That's great. Let's check it out. Yo, 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 this is Street Talk, I'm AJ, episode four, food edition. I'm gonna be asking students on campus about what their favorite Mexican food is. Check it out, boom. Who has better Mexican food, LA or the Bay? The Bay, Mission area, Mission district. What Mexican food slap, the Bay or the LA's? LA. Bay. Wait, you're from the Bay and you just said LA? Well, I just know that like everybody out there has like really good Mexican food. Uh -huh. I feel like we're more authentic. Mm. Again. I feel like we're more authentic. You heard that. You heard that. I'm gonna say the Bay. Yes, yeah, sir. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the Bay on that one. I've been to LA. I've been to the Bay too. I'm in the Bay right now. LA was kind of on it. It was kind of mid. I ain't gonna lie. It's kind of too hyped up, but the Bay got it. The Bay got it. The Bay got it. For yes. Sure. Does pineapples belong on pizza? That's a hard pass. I'm gonna say no. Why doesn't it belong on pizza? I know it's just too sweet. I don't know, man. That's, that belongs on like a fruit salad or something, not on pizza. <laughs> Does pineapple belong on pizza? Hell yeah. yeah what? Whoever, whoever say no is a hater, bro. Pineapple definitely belong on pizza. Put a little ham on there, put a little bacon on that shit. Shit's nuts. Nice. It's shit's nuts. Nice. Really? Hell yeah. Pineapple? Yes, bro. Yes. Does pineapples belong on pizza? Yeah. Depends. Depends what? I'll try it. Like, if it's in front of me, I'll take a bite, but okay. I'm not going to order it, you know? Right. What do you say? Yeah, it does. Wait, what? It does? Uh huh. Oh. So you go into Domino's, you saying, hey, let me get pineapple on pizza? Ham, uh, does pineapples belong on pizza? Yes, I love pineapple on pizza. Does food slap or smack? Uh, both, both. It what? Yeah, both. <laughs> no, it's, it's, it's smacks. Music slaps. Food smacks. Oh, okay, okay. That, that you guys, so anybody, if anybody asks you that, you're sanctioned, all right? You know what the answer is. So what is it? 
they, they can Food. Be. No. <laughs> Trust me. I'm, I'm putting you. I'm helping you out. So this okay. question: if, if someone were to ask you this in, in, in front of a, a big crowd, you want to be. You, we want to be ready for it, right? I, I do, but I think food can slap too. <laughs> and that's all I got for you. This has been Roy. I'm AJ. Street Talk. Back to you. Hello, and welcome to the game show, Beam Boozled, Never Have I Ever edition. I want to welcome our contestants, AJ, Naveed, and Christian for this special Never Have I Ever round. All right, before we begin the game, let me tell you how this game works. We've all played Never Have I Ever, right? Yes. Well, the game Never Have I Ever is a pretty classic one, as we all know. Essentially the same game here, but it's food related, and instead of using our fingers to count down what we've done, we'll be using jelly beans. To top it off, the jelly beans we're using are bean boozled, meaning the color that may look appealing, but the taste is horrendous. So yellow is usually buttered popcorn, but in this case, it can be a rotten egg. The contestants will have six never have I ever questions. When someone has done the act, they eat a bean boozled. But if they've never done it, then they're safe and are exempt from eating a jelly bean. Now that you know the game is about, let's begin. So Yo. good luck to all the contestants. Thank you. And uh, hopefully you get the, the good should. beans. Uh, so starting us off with question one. Never have I ever told someone their food was good when it was not. About honesty. Age old morals here, guys. Yeah. I admit. I have. I personally have. What about you? Yeah, I have to told people. All right. Yeah. Let's if do they it. suck, they suck. Okay. <laughs> Did it stop at birthday cake or dirty dishwasher? All right, let's take one of those. All the way down. AJ's there. favorite. Oh, just tree. Yeah. All right, take it. <laughs> take right. it. Take one. You. So who was it? Was it like a family member who, trying to protect their feelings a little bit? Nah, yeah. some friends. They they recommended a spot, and honestly, it was just mediocre. Mm -hmm. So all right, but you know, that hurts the most sometimes. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. It's either a birthdays or I'm gonna hate myself. Oh, oh, oh my fucking! Oh, 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 oh. That's some nasty, nasty stuff. <laughs> Who came over Damn. that company? I guess no one three won. Three three. Not that. Not, not great starting us out. Oh. That was bad. That was bad. All right, Why is it? Oh. That was bad. <laughs> that was bad. This thing should be banned from a market. <laughs> yeah, immediately. Moving on. Question two. Uh huh. Never have I ever bought food from campus. Ah. Uh, God. City, Nazaro, I have. All right. I'm doing that. Okay. Village yeah. market. You never have? No, I have. You have? I'd be surprised. What is it? Uh, pomegranate. pomegranate band old Band-Aid. All right. right there. So Here you, you go. Want to try it again? Yeah. Go. But I have bought food. You go. Oh, go okay. ahead. Grab yours. <laughs> go. AJ's superstitious. He's, he's grabbing his own. All right. Uh, I'm going to try this. All right, cheers, cheers guys. Again. Down the hatch. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. How's that one taste? Yes! <laughs> I got something good. Been lucky. Did it turn? Mm -mm. What was it? That was Band-Aid. That was some, <laughs> that was some, uh, yeah, like a. I'm a grand. Yes. I'm going to try it. Yeah, it tastes like a board, you know. I'm going to school. Bathroom. All right, question three. Never have I ever set off the smoke alarm. I have. What happened? Many times. It's just, you know, burned it. You gotta be careful. You're not good at yeah. cooking? Some yeah, of the no, smoke alarms are pretty sensitive, though. Didn't pay attention. What were you cooking? Hmm? What were you cooking? Egg. Eggs? Oh, oh man. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> yeah, I don't cook, so no. Yeah, and um, some french fries, some, you know. And make sure to keep the oh, windows french open. French fries, yeah. Yeah. Christian, you cook? I like rice and eggs. Hmm, okay. So go ahead, eat your egg. <laughs> you gotta spin it for us. Oh, I'll spin it. Okay. Wait, so is it just Naveed or? Christian? Yeah, no, I don't cook. I don't, I don't step <laughs> in that ever. No. You make cereal. <coughs> That's even the hardest thing to do. Wait. Uh... What do we got, Naveed? Banana. Oh, strawberry banana or a dead fish. <clears throat> go ahead. It's just me? Yeah, it's just you. All right. 
crossing my fingers for you. Mm, got it. Oh, okay. Question four. Never have I ever tried Mexican food. Ah, oh, of course everyone has. Mm -hmm. I mean, at least me. we're in San Francisco. I have not in my taco, man. Taco Tuesday. AJ, I'm having a hard time believing you right now. Yeah, yeah. I live in Oakland. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, it's my it. turn to spin. And what do we got? Uh, strawberry banana smoothie or dead fish? Oh, you try that. Uh, try it. Okay, okay, yeah, let's. All right. Oh, uh, no, I got this. Going for new flavors. Okay, peach or barf? <laughs> okay. Come on, guys. So, who's going? All, uh, of, us. all of us. All right, that's good. Because I'm that sure you've tried like Mexican. Food. That looks like it, huh? <laughs> yeah. He's going to kill you. All right, yeah. let's just hope to have a peachy time or suffer the consequences. Barfy time. Yep. <laughs> oh, that's barf. That's barf. <laughs> mm hmm. Let me get a good taste. One barf confirmed. That's bad barf. All right, AJ got through. AJ got it. How are you doing, Christian? I'm not doing very well. Taste good peachy? Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. For our last question, <coughs> and I know it's a bummer. We're wrapping up here, guys. Oh, uh, no. if only, I wish I had more questions. Oh, I, I want it. Suffer more. <laughs> <laughs> Never have I ever ruined a meal I cooked. Ruined a uh, That's me. If I remember right, AJ ruined a meal. Cook, so. I, I, yeah, I sometimes you don't cook. So yeah, I don't. Off the Maybe cereal. Cake. I put too much milk. <laughs> <laughs> Those yeah, that's, that's the worst. Ruin it, that's, that definitely ruins it. Spin it. All right. I definitely have. So I'll be joining you guys for this last bean. Right, Aww. Yeah. <laughs> what did you? Yeah. What was it? It's in the middle. The <laughs> top. The burger. Nah, let's nah, switch it up. No, 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 no. I don't want to do that one. Yeah, right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. What does it say? Let's get, the, let's get the blue one. Yeah. yeah. What is that? Buttered popcorn. Okay. Down. And yeah. rotten eggs. Or rotten egg. That's the most yellow. That's gonna be rotten. No, that looks like butter popcorn to me. All right. Butter. Cheers, butter. guys. Butter, let's cheers. Oh. <laughs> Take that. Take that. All right. Sorry. Hope it's and popcorn. Butter popcorn. I told you. Oh. Nailed it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think that, yeah, that's popcorn. What <laughs> <laughs> mm. that? Bro, that is... I'm chilling. You're chilling? <laughs> Bro. We're all going to go wash our mouth out, but thank you so much for joining us on the game show Bean Boozled, Never Have I Ever edition. But don't go anywhere, because you don't want to miss out on cool tunes by Cosmic Roots. Down and out, ain't feeling right. Down to go and catch a fly and get away. Cause sometimes life, it ain't so easy. Obstacles can make me weary. And I'm not the type to be needed. But this lapse in time, it, it made me realize that life can be so simple if you got love. Life can be so simple if you got love. Life can be so simple if you got love. Life can be so simple if you got love. No, no, yeah, yeah. So simple if you got love. Life can be so simple if you got love. Life can be so simple if you got love. Life can be so simple if you got love. Oh, without your love, I'm so lost. Oh, without your love, I made my fall. My world.
for the boy without short love, hey. Without short love, I'm so lost. So without short love, I think my fault. Without short love, my world falls apart. Without short love. Without your love, I'm so lost. Without your love, I face my faults. Without your love, my world falls apart. Without your love, I'm so lost. Without your love, I face my faults. Without your love, my world falls apart. Without your love, I'm so lost. Without your love, I face my faults. Without your love, my world falls apart. Yeah.
town near you. I hope you loved today's program as much as I did. I would want to thank our wonderful guests, Street Talk, and of course, Cosmic Roots. We appreciate your standing performance. Thank you once again. You'll want to check in next week for the next episode of Under SF Debate, where we get further into jobs and internships. But until then, Gators, be intentional about having a good time. Keep a late down, then vibes not let us straight the love.